Nicaragua's strategic role in global migration and geopolitics. Nicaragua's strategic migration policies. Under the leadership of President Daniel Ortega, Nicaragua has, by easing visa regulations and improving international air services, Nicaragua has become a gateway for migrants seeking entry into the United States. This transformative approach has attracted individuals from diverse nations, such as India, Cuba, Haiti, and various African countries, who now prefer this alternative route over the treacherous Darien Gap jungle between Panama and Colombia. Through its forward-thinking policies, Nicaragua is not only facilitating safe and efficient migration, but also shaping the geopolitical landscape in ways that demand attention and contemplation. Flight paths of migrants through Nicaragua. Nicaragua has emerged as a significant transit point for migrants from India, Cuba, Haiti, and various African nations who are seeking to reach the United States. This increase in migration can be attributed to the country's strategic migration policies, implemented by President Daniel Ortega. These policies, which have gained attention on an international level, include the introduction of more lenient visa regulations and the improvement of international air services. By implementing these measures, Nicaragua has become an attractive option for migrants looking for easier ways to travel to the United States. This strategic positioning has impacted the country's economy and raised important discussions regarding immigration policies and their consequences. Charter flights, a key component, a significant part of this migration process involves charter flights. In recent months, there has been a notable increase in the number of charter flights believed to be carrying migrants from Haiti that have landed in Nicaragua. This influx of migrants has created a sense of urgency among the Biden administration and Latin American leaders who are now working tirelessly to find effective solutions. According to flight tracking data analyzed by Manuel Orozco, director of the Migration, Remittances and Development Program at the Inter-American Dialogue and the Associated Press, 268 charter flights have been recorded from Haiti to Nicaragua since the beginning of August. These charter airlines have transported approximately 31,000 individuals out of Haiti, accounting for nearly 60% of the Haitians who have arrived at the U.S. border seeking asylum or a better life. Additionally, around 172 flights carried approximately 17,000 people from Cuba to Nicaragua during the same time frame. This significant increase in charter flights from Haiti and Cuba to Nicaragua highlights the scale of the migration challenges faced by the region. It underscores the need for comprehensive and collaborative efforts to address the root causes of migration, improve living conditions in the countries of origin, and establish more effective border control measures. The situation demands the cooperation and coordination of governments, international organizations and civil society to ensure the well-being and safety of all migrants involved. Financial and strategic implications, economic gains. Nicaragua benefits economically through visa fees or tourist cards depending on the nationality of incoming passengers. In addition to landing taxes, this strategy has become a lucrative business for the Ortega administration, providing much needed financial support to Nicaragua's economy. The revenue generated from these visa fees and landing taxes can contribute to developing Nicaragua's infrastructure, education and healthcare systems. By investing in these sectors, the government can improve its citizens' overall quality of life and attract more tourists to boost the economy further. Tactical silence, the government's lack of public commentary on its migration policy, suggests a deliberate strategy, potentially to avoid international criticism. This silence may also be a tactical move in the broader geopolitical landscape. This deliberate strategy of tactical silence could be a means for the government to carefully assess and monitor the impact of its migration policy without drawing unnecessary attention. By keeping their plans undisclosed, the government can make adjustments and adaptations to ensure the policy's effectiveness in addressing domestic and international concerns. This approach allows the government to maintain flexibility and control over the narrative surrounding its migration policy. China-Nicaragua relations a new dimension. Beijing's growing influence, China's strengthening ties with Nicaragua, especially after Nicaragua severed relations with Taiwan, mark a significant geopolitical shift. In addition, this development not only indicates China's growing influence in the region, but also highlights its willingness to support nations like Nicaragua in the face of sanctions from Western countries. Implications of the China-Nicaragua Partnership The China-Nicaragua Free Trade Agreement and the strategic partnership between the two countries signify a potential shift in Nicaragua's economic reliance and political alignment. Moreover, 
As Nicaragua faces sanctions from Western countries, support from China becomes even more crucial, providing the country with an alternative source of economic and political support. Mexico's divergent approach. Under significant pressure from the United States, Mexico has implemented a distinctive approach in response to U.S. immigration policies. This approach primarily centers around the implementation of repatriation flights and the implementation of various measures aimed at curbing the northward movement of migrants. It is worth noting that these actions undertaken by Mexico serve to underscore the contrasting strategies adopted by different countries in the region when it comes to dealing with U.S. immigration policies. Consequences and Global Reactions Weaponizing migration, Nicaragua's approach has faced criticism for its use of migration as a tool in foreign policy against the U.S. This strategy, often referred to as weaponizing migration, involves leveraging the movement of people to exert significant pressure on the U.S. and neighboring countries. As a result, there has been a noticeable increase in charter flights from Haiti and Cuba to Nicaragua, further highlighting the impact of this strategy. Human Trafficking Concerns it's essential to recognize that along with increased migration flows, there have been growing concerns about human trafficking networks taking advantage of this situation. Reports suggest that criminal organizations have exploited vulnerable migrants, subjecting them to exploitation, abuse, and the risk of human trafficking. Addressing these grave humanitarian issues should be a paramount concern for both regional and international authorities. Impact on regional and U.S. policies the surge in migration has compelled the Biden administration to implement new strategies, such as the Humanitarian Parole Program, to manage the influx of migrants at the U.S.-Mexico border effectively. However, the consequences of this migration strategy are not limited to the U.S. alone. In regions like Tapachula, Mexico, where migrants often face challenges and frustrations, tensions continue to persist. Acknowledging the wider implications and repercussions of this approach on regional and U.S. policies is crucial. Combating human trafficking. Given the rise in migration and the potential for human trafficking, international cooperation becomes pivotal in addressing this multifaceted challenge. Collaborative efforts between countries, law enforcement agencies and organizations are essential to combat human trafficking, protect the rights of migrants and ensure their safety throughout their journey. Looking ahead, geopolitical and humanitarian considerations. Nicaragua's policies raise critical questions about future responses from the United States and other countries in the region. These policies can potentially bring about significant changes in terms of concessions and the overall impact on the migrants who use Nicaragua as a transit point. Furthermore, as Nicaragua aligns more closely with China and challenges U.S. policies, the geopolitical landscape in Central America could undergo considerable transformations. In conclusion, Nicaragua's migration policies and its strengthening ties with China have far-reaching implications for various aspects such as regional politics, U.S. foreign policy and the lives of thousands of migrants. It is crucial for the international community to carefully navigate these complex dynamics as they address the geopolitical challenges and humanitarian concerns that arise from this evolving situation.